I know you've mentioned to us about your regulatory status, something that you're very, very proud of. Can you elaborate on this? Just shortly after incorporation in 2017, we, we coupled with a leading compliance consultancy to start our FCA approval in the UK. And uh, after a number of months that was approved and we were granted rights to both advise and manage money for both retail and professional clients. And I think that managing money aspect is, is quite important for a new startup. It was, it was quite a large hurdle to get and really allowed us to focus on initially growing the discretionary and advisory book. Then as we had a large client base and a large proportion of clients in South Africa, we also applied to the then FSB, now F FSCA, to register as a foreign service provider, which allowed us to first um, advise and, and market the business in South Africa. So by starting off with that initial set of, of regulation, we managed to grow the discretionary book, which got the business to scale, and we could then turn our attention to the fund. We looked at a number of different regimes and frameworks for the, the fund authorization, and we decided that USIS provided the best framework that was both um, secure, credible, and scalable for our clients and ourselves. So. Um, we also looked at different jurisdictions and decided that Ireland was the most closely aligned with ourselves and our business. So we, uh, we registered ourselves with the Central Bank of Ireland where we were approved as investment manager for the fund and then uh, chose President as the administrator with uh, the very credible Northern Trust as a custodian. And in, in line with that South African connection around our, our registration as a foreign service provider, we knew that the fund would have large reach and, and um, availability in South Africa. So we registered as a Section 65 fund, which would allow us to market and sell, and, and sell the fund to investors in South Africa. David, thank you so much for joining us. And thank you to you for watching Black Onyx.